Let me unbutton my pants, girl, because I am. <laughs> hey, y'all. Welcome to another day in the life of a vlog. Today is, it's like 6 o'clock right now. I'm about to go to the supermarket because I'm doing a meal prep for the next three days. It's Thursday, so I'm, meal, no, it's Wednesday. So I'm meal prepping for tomorrow, Friday, and Saturday. So I wanted to grab some plantains, and that's really it um, for my meal prep. And that's it. So, yeah. So yeah, tomorrow I'm gonna be getting my brows done. So I'm gonna take you guys with me for the day. I'm not, I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to show you guys the whole process. Like I don't know her policy or anything like that. So we'll see once I get there. But I'm definitely gonna show you guys like before and after. Whatever I can, I'll show you. And I also wanted to pick up a little luxury item tomorrow. So we'll be going to get that as well. And I'm excited. So yep, let's go to the supermarket. I'm wearing this top from Abercrombie. I showed y'all in my last haul. Um, I'm wearing this purse. This is from Angela Roy. And then I'm wearing sweatpants. Such a basic outfit. It is so hot. I did not realize it was this temperature. It's literally like 90 degrees in here. Hopefully the camera doesn't fall. I'm gonna try to move real slow. This is a bad idea. Oh, this is a bad idea. <laughs> I cannot afford. Oh, we cannot afford that. So I did order a new tripod um, for the camera. I got one of the, um, I got the tripod that it was supposed to come with, but why is it not, but why am I not in focus? All right, y'all, so, whew, it is hot. All right, I'm gonna turn on the AC so I can talk real quick. I just got to the supermarket, so I'm gonna run in and grab what I need to grab for that. But anyways, what I was telling you guys earlier is I ordered a tripod for this camera that you can use to like start and rec um, stop and record video. You could also use the tripod to take pictures. So basically like, it's like you have all these options right in front of you instead of having to touch the top of the camera, which I think is pretty cool. And um, the camera's supposed to come with it, but I got just the camera itself. Look, like, not supposed to actually. Like the camera, this camera has a kit where you get all those things together, but my Best Buy did not have the kit available and I wanted the camera right now like i needed it now i wanted it i'm one of those people that i be wanting things like right now like i need to go in the store get it and go home i don't want to order it online all the time just got home i have my groceries in here i just went to shop right if you live in new york city area like you know about shop right anyways i got these this is literally all i went to get y'all my doodles i literally just went to get my doodles because i love it i got three boxes and i know it's not lazy like i could just do it myself but i'm not lazy so these give your food a nice little extra sweet kick i literally only put two in each of my little containers all right so i'm in the kitchen i'm in the kitchen right now i'm gonna meal prep a little bit i don't know if i want to show you guys the whole process because it's like kind of boring but um if you want to see that let me know i'll do it in another i'll do it in a future vlog but i'm just gonna do the chicken the chicken has been marinating for like an hour since when i went to the grocery store so i'm gonna just put it in the um pot right now the chicken all right so this is the marinated chicken all right i'm gonna put it in this dutch pot right here to cook and that's it i just put a little bit of olive oil um, this, I just put a little bit of olive oil on the bottom and I'm just cooking it like this. I'll see you guys later. I need to go respond to comments on the video that I just uploaded. So that's what I'm going to do when the chicken is like pretty much like done. So I'm about to respond to some comments now. Well, all the comments right now that I have so far and I will talk to you guys later. I just got done doing the comments for now. I'm about to go check on my chicken to see if it's good. Ooh. Good morning, y'all. It is the next day and I probably look insane. I just woke up. Um, well, I didn't just wake up. I just did my skincare. So I woke up like an hour ago. And um, yeah, today is microblading day. I did my, I did a little skincare. I'll show you guys what I use because I've been really, really enjoying this product. So I'm in the bathroom. I'm gonna open up the cabinet. You guys have seen my cabinet before, but I have been obsessed with this product. This is the Paula's Choice Exfoliate 
um, 2%, let me just take it out, is the 2% um, BHA Salicylic Exfoliant, and girl, my skin has been looking really good from this, so I definitely would recommend it if you're looking for something, um, if you have acne prone skin, I think it's really, really good. So, adding this to my skincare routine in the morning and evening has definitely made a big change, and um, yeah, I've been loving it. Um, I also used this guy this morning and i do need to add in a sunscreen once i am about to head out the door but yeah that's what i did for skincare i'm gonna use this moisturizer like i said this is so dangerous because if the camera falls if the camera falls i'll cry like i literally will cry i'm gonna put this on real quick So I was going to have coffee this morning, but I was reading online that it's not good to have coffee before getting your brows microbladed. Something to do with like um, bleeding and scarring or whatever, I'm not really sure. But I saw it online, so now that I know, I feel like I can't drink the coffee. Like if I didn't know, it would be fine. But I know now, like I read it. So now I'm like, crap, I can't drink coffee. So I think I might make some tea. I don't know. I want to drink something though because I usually drink something in the morning and then I don't eat again till like 1. This is my little tea area. I try not to have too many calories in the morning um, because I want to really start eating around 1. But the problem is when I drink coffee, I could drink it black. But tea, I just feel like I need sugar. Um, green tea has caffeine, so I can't even do that. Um, detox tea had last night chamomile is good but it's gonna put me right to sleep <laughs> oh my gosh i just i can't drink any of these really does this one have caffeine maybe i'll just drink this one let's see this one has no caffeine um i think i'm gonna drink this one i actually just got kind of dressed um you can hear my kids upstairs but um i threw on a little outfit because let me show you guys so i'm wearing this white tank this is from my abercrombie haul that i showed you guys um, last vlog and then I'm wearing this over it. This is from Boohoo, but I got this last year So I'm pretty sure they probably don't have it anymore. And then then my jeans are from good American. So that's my outfit I'm gonna just throw my bracelets back on because I took them out yesterday um, The first one is this Pandora bracelet Here this bracelet is so hard to get on by myself like it's literally always a struggle and then I throw on my other bracelets This is my second piece maybe i'll just leave it like this today i don't know kind of cute i do need some anklets though like i really want to add some anklets to my collection i don't have any anklets side part low bun for my hair that should be cute because i can't really do much to it since we're gonna be doing my brows and since i'm gonna be laying down anyways um i feel like i'm repeating myself 10 times anyway my phone is charging i'm gonna leave the house around 10 30 like 10 20 actually i'm gonna leave the house um i guess i'll show you guys a package that i got in the mail from fab pit fun um i love their packages and they sent me one so i'll show you guys that not sponsored but they did send it and they told me i could share it if i want to so i'll share it with y'all <laughs> first of all this is from ColourPop. actually i'll show you guys this one this is from ColourPop, and i will definitely be doing a look with the with this collection but that's gonna probably be like next week or the week after just because i'm getting the brows done today so i can't wear makeup for another week so i'm probably gonna have to film this next week and then i'll upload it the following week but really excited to try this collection out it looks really really fun okay so this is the box clearly i already opened it but oh my gosh my okay so this is the booklet it always comes with a little magazine and it tells you all about the products it also usually has recipes and different fun stuff like that in the book so this is the book for this one okay and then it came with all these cool things so first of all we have this um golden superfood this is an antioxidant shower gel I will definitely be trying this this is from beauty pampia that just sounds fancy then we have this crease release um from the laundress and it is a wrinkle remover girl i need this in my life <laughs> all right um next we have a glow glossmetics 
hair removal device and it's supposed to be removing hair okay we could do with that we could we could definitely benefit from one of those so i'm gonna try this out this is what it looks like it's basically like one of these like yeah i'm gonna try this out for sure next we have a cuticle oil yes i love these these are perfect for my nails i'm gonna put this on right now because i always have the worst cuticles i got a little backpack this is from botkier botkier i think it's pronounced but it's really cute it has a little um flap here to zipper pockets and this is the inside it's really really cute and um, the straps on the back really cute stuff and then we have here this is a slip a sleeping mist Ooh, definitely cannot wait to try this anastasia clear brow gel that's always a bonus i love that i'm gonna stand because my feet are tingling this is sometimes you don't need an inspirational quote you just need wine so this is 50 percent off your first six personalized wine matches from bright sellers okay girl like this is definitely gonna be put to use <laughs> then we have this jenny bird uh jewelry so i already opened this so i know what's in here and it's super cute it's all my, my hair y'all but anyways let me show you guys the bracelet let me just make sure my background is looking good okay nothing embarrassing so this is the bracelet it's so cute this is what it looks like here you can see it has two tones silver and gold typically i wear a lot of gold um but sometimes i do want to wear a silver like handbag or like not a silver handbag but a handbag with silver hardware and this is perfect because now my jewelry kind of matches um everything all right let's go to my hair so i'm gonna use the curls um pomade for the front of my hair this is just a edge control paste and well it's not i don't know if it's an edge control paste actually it is a yeah it's a control paste and then i'm gonna just take my brush and brush it down like that and then brush it off okay put it in a little like fake i did a little bun back there all right so that's my little hairstyle a little bun in the back and that's it like i can't really do anything to my face because obviously it's in my brows and um i think it looks cute i'm so embarrassed i put y'all on here and then i was talking for like 10 minutes and then not 10 minutes maybe five minutes and then the camera just like closed in because it was never recording stupid anyways um this looks weird uh, don't mind the mess. I was filming a bunch of videos this week. I had a couple sponsorships that I had to film um, by the first week in August. I also had to film pre. I also had to pre-film videos because I'm doing my brows. Obviously, I said that like ten times in this video already, but <laughs> um, but I can't wear makeup for the whole week, so I had to pre-film that way I would have content for y'all. Anyways, I put y'all here because I'm about to pack my little purse. And while I was um, looking for a bag to wear today, I realized that I really needed a purse that would go with this outfit like a crossbody because I really wanted to wear a crossbody bag but I only have four crossbodies that I would like really wear and none of the ones that I have I would want to wear like I have two that would match and they're both like hot pink one is like hot pink one is like hot peach kind of and I love them they're cute but I will I don't feel like wearing hot pink bag today or a hot peach bag the other crossbody I have is a baby pink so it won't really match this outfit that well is it a baby pink it's like a beige but I just feel like this matches better though I wish I had the Alma BB like the little crossbody one kind of want to put that on my wish list because I think it will match this look in here I already put my airpods because I'm definitely gonna need those because I'm gonna be sitting down in a chair or like laying down in a chair for a while so i have airpods i have my spare battery for my camera and i'm gonna put another spare one in here but the spare that spare one is currently charging so i'm gonna have two batteries and then one in the camera so i'll be good i also put i also have my glossier lip gloss i'm probably not gonna wear it much though because i have a mask on but it's okay then i have some hand sanitizer this is from germex and this is great essential for this time and forever honestly after this you're gonna need hand sanitizer every yeah ever <laughs> i have a mask i'm gonna wear because you have to wear masks outside girl i got my key sunglasses these are the desi perkin um i think they're called like 
frame less or something like that rim less I got these really cute I love these they're so nice I definitely do want to get a pair from her new line I'm just not sure which one I want to get yet because they all look so good her Desi line they look really really good all right and then I have my wallet this is the one I showed you guys last time this is the Louis Vuitton Victorine wallet I just think it's so cute I had it for like about two weeks now and I really love it it's so cute and that's basically all that I'm bringing with me I'm also gonna bring my self-care envelope of um, self-care funds <laughs> that's how I portion or not portion like budget my money so yeah this is for my brows okay so that's basically it y'all um, I'm gonna put some perfume on I'm gonna wear by readouts I'm gonna wear this one today this is my um, Sundays the bye bye Rito. Burrito. Hey y'all, so I'm in the car right now. I am leaving a little bit earlier than I planned to because I have to get gas. I just realized, well, I just remembered. So I'm gonna just um, leave a little earlier. I'm in the parking lot garage, so it's like really bad lighting in here, but I just got to Nordstrom. It's 10.51, so it opens in nine minutes, so I'm early. I'm back in the car, I just got done at the mall. So I got, I made a little purchase. I'm gonna show you guys what I got um, once we get home. So I just got to the parking lot at the brow place i'm pretty early i'm like 40 minutes early i figured i was gonna get here early but i wanted to make sure that i knew exactly where the place was and everything i still don't know where it is exactly because my um my gps told me like oh i'm here but i didn't see anything so i need to go walk and see like in real life um i also went to sephora which was totally unplanned so i'll show you guys what i got there i guess because that was an unplanned trip so i'll put you guys somewhere my battery died okay I'll just take everything out of my bag first okay so this is everything that i got from sephora so i'm gonna put these bags in the trunk real quick i'm gonna pay the meter and i'll talk to you guys later just got done um i'll show you guys more in the car but oh my gosh i am freaking obsessed wow okay i'm gonna put my hat on so I'm back home. My brows are done. They are a little bit dark. They're going to get lighter over time. They look so good. I am so impressed. I love the way they turned out. I, yeah, the experience was the experience was really nice. Basically, she applied a numbing cream. She waited like, oh, let me unbutton my pants, girl, because I am. <laughs> she applied a numbing cream. She waited like 20 minutes. Then she did the stencil to basically draw out the shape. And this is the shape that I liked. It's basically my brow shape, um, but like perfected a little bit. And then she, um, after she drew it out, asked me if I liked it. Then we went ahead and started the process. I got micro, I got combo combination brows. So I have micro shading and micro blading. So since I have oily combination skin, um, she rec she recommended that I do a more shading because the shading lasts better with um, oily skin so I did more shading than micro but um yeah I did a combination of both that was her recommendation and I actually had read that online last night and I wasn't really sure like you know much I didn't know much about it but I was happy that she explained that to me before I even told her that I had just read that all right so these are the brows they look so good um I personally love them I think they look amazing um in terms of how much pain it is it's really up to your pain tolerance i'm a chicken when it comes to this type of pain any type of pain with dentist face like it hurts me so badly so for me i felt pain she added more numbing cream and then i didn't feel it anymore you do hear the little sound of like scratching and i feel like that is more so the trigger than the actual pain um so i just blasted music in my airpods so i wouldn't hear it as much and um i was done pretty quickly i want to say like an hour the whole like 
micro bleeding part lasted about an hour probably um after getting numb and everything like that so yeah it was a great experience i have to go back to get a touch up in about a month or two or so or so okay she woke up like this okay <laughs> all right so i'm not allowed to wet them for a week i'm not allowed to um go in the sun too much um basically that can change the color and alter the color and um, i have an and ointment to apply to it to just help with the healing process for morning and nighttime so that's basically the aftercare um routine and then also no glycolic acids like aha acids none of that on my brows which i'm happy to know because i would have put that on there so well not today obviously but like eventually um i'm not really like thinking about that when i do my my skin routine i'm not thinking to avoid my brows but now i know i'm gonna have to avoid my brows because that could alter the color or fade it or whatever i don't know what it does as i mentioned earlier i did stop at neiman marcus so i will show you guys what i picked up there i got a new perfume i'll show you guys what it is this is the box you guys have seen this box before when i showed you my other burrito perfume over a couple months ago but i got this one i've been hearing a lot about this i saw it first on monroe steel's instagram she does have a youtube channel as well so i love her content so much and then recently i saw it again on brianna monique's channel and i was like you know what i need to go smell this so i went and i could barely smell it y'all because i had a mask on oh my gosh y'all while I was there buying this perfume, <laughs> the sales associate who helped me, he's actually the same one who helped me when I was purchasing Baccarat um, two years ago. He was obsessed with my kimono. He was like so in love with it. He was like, it's so beautiful. I love this. This print is beautiful. What designer is this? I was rolling. I literally wanted to die. <laughs> this is from Boohoo. And he was like asking about the designer. And I was like, oh no, sir. I got it online. Like, <laughs> what? <laughs> It's so funny. Like, I was gonna say it's from Boohoo, but then I'm like, he's gonna be like, what's a Boohoo? But I was like, you know what? I was like, the easiest thing to just say, I got it online. And that's what I said, and it was just so funny. But he loved it, and it was funny. Anyways, um, this is what I got. So this is it here. This smells so good. This reminds me of just like luxury and like a rich queen, okay? It smells really good. I love it. It smells amazing. It's actually different than anything that I have in my collection, but I love the different notes that it has. I'm going to list the notes on here, but basically I remember um, it has jasmine, it has um, lavender, I love those, it has bergamot, I tend to love that, musk, which I also tend to love. When these are all mixed together, that sounds like my type of perfume that's not sweet, it's definitely grown and sexy, okay? Then I got this little item here. I'm so excited you guys this is the box oh my gosh oh my gosh this is the case I chose you had an option of this case or like a pouch I like this one just because I feel like it's a little bit more sturdy and this is the inside here really nice I love this material very nice and beautiful and then you have your little cleaning cloth the lady who helped me told me that i should never put sunglasses on my head and i about died because girl i always put sunglasses on my head but yeah she also said to lay them down on the top part not on the bottom part so i was like okay thanks for the tips yeah anyways so are you guys ready i got these oh my gosh you guys i'm obsessed i love them these are newer i believe and they're similar to the more popular style that has the curved bottom but i feel like these were just so bad like i love the style on the side it says um can you guys see that on the inside it says celine paris and then on this side it also says celine with the three dots um this is a tortoise style and i don't want to touch my brows but this is how it looks it fits perfectly i love them you guys they look so good and you see my brows which i do like i like that you can still see my brows i could even wear them down like this if i want you to see my brows even more this is definitely sunday brunch vibe you know i love this i cannot wait to wear these out and also and this part you guys can see this part is not that narrow like it could fit a lot of different noses so those are my two purchases i showed you guys what i got at sephora earlier but i guess i'll open up 
the lip gloss and try it on so i did show y'all what i got at sephora earlier but i guess i will try out the perfume not perfume the body spray i'll try it out and then also i want to swatch the foundation and the lip gloss so you guys will see what those look like this is sweet mouth from fancy and i see a lot of people using this shade it's very pale it's a little like it's pretty pale it's cute i feel like it would look better on me over like a nice nude lipstick with a, a brown lip liner but it's a cute color i do like it um then i got the foundation like i told y'all earlier i showed y'all earlier um this is the new um new Too face matte foundation born this way matte and it does come with a pump. It's a slimmer bottle than the other one. It's a longer bottle as well. I got the shade Chai. Um, I'm not sure how long. It says undetectable, super long wear, oil-free, oil control, and waterproof transfer resistant. I'm not really sure. Oh, it's very light coverage. Like, um, it's a very lightweight, I mean to say. Very lightweight foundation. I'm not sure how much coverage it's going to give because it's very, very lightweight. Wow. But it's blended in really nice into my hand as you can see right here okay i'm definitely gonna have to try this on my face and i really wish i could try it like now but i can't so i'm gonna have to wait about a week to try this on i cannot wait to try it you guys i feel like it's gonna look amazing we all were just down here <laughs> i'm just kidding i'll try it out next week it feels really good though and i cannot wait to try it on my face so i'm gonna have it right here I need to clean my desk. My desk is such a disaster. And then I got this like I showed y'all earlier. Once again, this one is from Tom Ford and it's the Soleil Blanc um, Body Glitter. So I got the travel size perfume last week or two weeks ago. I love the scent. It smells amazing. I don't even know where it's at. That's how good it smells. Like it's in one of my purses. I have no idea where it's at. I need the real size. That way I can keep it in my perfume area and I will always have it there. Um, it smells so good. They didn't have the real size in... Actually, they did have it, but they had the older um, toilet, not the parfum. So I didn't get that. But either way, I already had gotten the burrito, so it probably I probably wouldn't have gotten it anyway. So um, that's doing the most. <laughs> All right. So this is the um, this is the Tom Ford one. By the way, Neiman Marcus, they told me they were gonna have a sale next week. Um, I need to go look online to see if I could figure out what's gonna be on sale because girl, I need to go get some more perfumes. I wanna do like some more luxury perfumes in my collection. All right, anyways, this is the Tom Ford Soleil Blanc. I cannot wait to use this because the perfume smells so good. Oh my gosh, it smells so freaking good. Wow, this is literally, smells so good. This is literally amazing, like you guys, wow. I know I have a lot of these. I know I've shown you guys so many of these things in the past month, but I'm obsessed with these types of, oh my gosh. I'm obsessed with these. This one smells so good, like, ugh. And it goes with this scent, actually. It does go with um, Baldia Fuique pretty well so that's good i'm excited this is my little haul y'all i'm so excited i love everything except the Too Faced. i can't really try it yet but on my hand it looks amazing it looks really good like it looks bomb and i was trying to see if i should get a different shade just because it's summertime and I, my skin tone might be a little different but i think this one looks fine right now as well so yeah that's everything that i got you guys um also one more thing about the brows they are gonna get lighter i was told so this is not gonna look this they're not gonna look this dark although i don't mind um they are gonna get lighter and then when i go for my touch up you can customize a little bit more if i feel like customizing more but yeah that's the last thing i think i, should, I have to tell y'all about the brows but other than that um I need to go eat something in about an hour or so. I have to upload a video. I have to respond to comments on my last video. Thank you all so much. And um, yeah, I'm going to talk to you guys later. If I don't talk to you guys later, I'll see you guys in my next video. But if not, I'll talk to you all later. <laughs>